guys, what's up? Today uh, we're going to be doing a, a very, very useful video actually. Um, I actually just tried this off a online forum and believe it or not, it worked. Uh, there actually has been a, quite a lot of complaints about the iPhone 4 home button not working. Uh, as you can see now, it is working. But before, it was completely unresponsive. And unfortunately, I rang up Apple and said, this is the problem. They said, send it in. Uh, I didn't want to send it in. Uh, I haven't got time to waste uh, waiting two or three weeks for my phone to be fixed. Or oh, the other option was for them to be sending out, sending out a uh, refurbished model uh, and keeping my model and fitting it and sending it out to somebody else. I wasn't happy with that. Um, there was also another thing I rang up my service carrier and they said send it in and uh, we'll send it out. Uh, obviously that is not an option for a lot of people. Uh, there actually is a quick fix. So just for demonstrative purposes, let's just say the iPhone 4 button is not working. Uh, now look, it is going to work when I press it. Okay, but um, before it was not working, so that was a big problem. Uh, what I did actually was I have this here. Obviously, you know what this is, an iPhone cable, or an iPod cable, iPod Touch, whatever you have cable, uh, plugged into my Mac, and I read that if you just plug this in, like so, and then you hold down this button, voice control will come up. Now, this is very useful because it reactivates the home button. Even though it shouldn't have to reactivate the home button, it still reacts the, reactivates the home button. So that's a useful tool. Uh, thanks to the online forum where I found this. Make sure you subscribe at the top. Go through this again. All you need to do is plug that iPhone or iPod in. You know what you need to do? Just hold down that home button. And there you go. Thanks for watching, guys. See you in the next video. Make sure to subscribe above.